So we killed some coyotes last night and I've decided that I'm done not showing people this stuff because it's important for you to realize what we go through for agriculture. We have four female coyotes that we took down between like three and five this morning and uh, two of them are pregnant. One of them had already had her pups and they are done gone. So you're sitting there thinking, why is this important? Why do we need to know this shit? What are we doing here? Well, here's the deal. I'm here at the entrance to my property. There's a cemetery on the edge of my property. That's the biggest open space on my property. And everything else is forest. So all of these woods behind me, mm-hmm, yeah, all of that. And I gotta pick up that cup. I don't know who dumped that cup. But all of that, is a breeding ground for vermin. They take out my livestock, they take out the wildlife, and when they're done with the wildlife, they come after my dogs, so they die. This is what we do with coyotes in Ohio. Pretty, huh? The only good coyote is a dead coyote, look at that. We had a good night last night, and our babies are all ready to go for another one. Nice. So the question you must be asking yourself is, does she feel bad about it? No, I don't. Because it's all part of the cycle of life. This is how the real world works, boys and girls. I'm not your vegan teacher. I don't really give a shit what she thinks. And I still love the animals. I can love them and know their purpose in life and still be a responsible husbandryman.